Greetings, you're on the famous Room channel. No one expected Lana to turn out to be a real person besides David Murphy. From the moment Murphy told 90 Day Fiancé before the 90 Days viewers about her, it all seemed like a scam, but on the May 10th episode of the show, it was revealed that Lana wasn't a catfish at all, and in leaked footage from the Tell All special, we learned even more about the Ukrainian beauty. Murphy was specifically searching for Ukrainian women when he met Lana. When the internet was brand new, a tenant of mine showed me a website where you could meet Russian and Filipino women. He wrote in a Q&A on Instagram of how he got into dating foreign women. I had an interest in Russians. Within months, the Ukrainian women on the site outnumbered the Russians. I went to both countries. A few years later, Ukraine became more Western-like and you didn't even need a visa to go there. Russia requires a visa and you have to register everywhere you go. It was just harder to travel in. After he discovered those dating sites, he began solely dating Ukrainian women. I stopped dating in the USA 15 years ago, he wrote. Every time I did, I would start thinking about Ukraine, so I stopped trying so my heart was free just in case I went to Ukraine. I have dated well over 100 women in Ukraine, turned down many marriage proposals and have been turned down twice myself. On his fifth attempt to meet Lana, she finally showed up. He proposed to her and the two got engaged. Unfortunately, a little while later, Lana called off the engagement. Right now, I would say we are not together, he said in the footage of the tell-all. I'm not going to say we won't be together in the future. She's under way too much stress with what's going on with the show and the people who bother her. I told her that's part your fault, you can get off. One of the most surprising things that we'll learn about Lana in the upcoming episodes is that she doesn't speak any English. So she and Murphy have been having a relationship for seven years where they can really communicate. Another weird thing about Lana is that she told Murphy that she wants a quiet life. She's undergoing way too much stress with this show, Murphy said at the tell-all. She told me a couple of weeks ago all she wanted was a white picket fence and traveling with me in the RV. She loves that idea. This is strange, because though we don't know exactly how many gifts or how much Murphy has spent on her in the past, we do know that he has given her something and has spent hundreds of thousands of dollars on the dating website. So she doesn't really sound like a girl who just wants the basics in life. In addition, we find out more about how the dating website that Lana is a part of works. According to Murphy, she had to sign up with an agency in order to get on the website. She talked to multiple men in order to increase her chances of getting the K-1 visa, Murphy even admits that Lana is still on the dating sites. That's it for now, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to stay tuned.